what are my people them i hope everybody's feeling blessed feeling grateful if you're new to my channel welcome and please don't forget to subscribe much appreciated as you guys can see from the title i am making cmos gel today with that being said let's get right into it so this is a product that i personally purchased unfortunately i didn't buy it from an online website so i can't share a link however if you're based in north london i brought it from a small Mauritian market and they had a wide variety of different cmos there are loads of small businesses and big businesses online that are selling it so i'm quite sure you guys will be able to find it easily for those who don't know cmos grows in a number of colors such as various shades of green yellow purple red brown and black the one that i have at the moment is like a ready yellow color there's no specific shade of color you need to get they're all the same as long as they're 100 percent natural then we are good to go when you first purchase the sea moss, the texture is very hard and don't seem like something that came out the sea until you smell it and then you damn well know it came out the sea. So I'm just going to go ahead now and give it a quick little rinse just in case it has any built up dirt or sand on it just to be on the safe side. As you guys can see, I am using bottled water to give it a rinse and not tap water. I would advise you guys to use bottled water. After I've rinsed my sea moss, I'm just going to leave it to soak in some bottled water and give it a good wrap with some cling film. After you finish putting the cling film on top and it's all wrapped up nicely, you're going to let it sit between 12 to 48 hours. Twenty-four hours later. wow it's literally tripled the size it has expanded so much now this feels and looks like something that has come out of the sea i can't explain the texture of it but it's like gooey it's slimy it feels like i've just taken it out of the sea it feels so fun to play with that like i keep playing with it okay let me stop playing with it now nope i'm back i'm playing with it still <laughs> As you guys can see, I have drained out all the water from the sea moss. I've just got it sitting on the plate at the moment. As you can see, I have a small handheld blender so I can only put in a certain amount of sea moss at a time. I then added in some water, not tap water. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna give it a quick little blend. The benefits of sea moss, it boosts your immune system, it gets rid of body mucus, it improves breathing My asthmatic people out there like me, it purifies the blood, it helps regulate blood pressure, increases energy, helps with women's health, it helps your hair, nails, skin and teeth, helps with joints and muscle pain, improves sexual performance, helps to conceive, helps with digestive issues and so much more. The texture you're looking for is kind of like an applesauce type of texture. Some people want it a bit more smoother, so if you do, just blend it up for a bit longer. If you're happy with it like that, then you are good to go. For those who don't know, Irish Moss has 92 minerals out of the 102 minerals that you need for your body. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Did you hear what I just said? 92 minerals out of 102 that we need for our body like how amazing is that seriously especially the time that we are going through at the moment which is covid and this whole pandemic situation as much vitamins and nutrients that you guys can get for your body i advise you guys to take it in march 2020 i actually lost my scent and taste and this genuinely helped me get it back it still comes and goes but it's helped me so much i can't explain it and my mum suffers with arthritis and it's helped her as well. I'm not a doctor and I can't give out medical advice, but it has helped me and my family so much. So I hope it can help yours as well. The question everybody's asking, how do you use CMOS? So there are different types of ways of using it. You're able to apply it directly to your skin or your hair, or you're able to consume it like the way I'm going to show you now. There are so many different ways that you guys can consume it. As you just saw, I added in one teaspoon to my cornmeal porridge. 
and added a bit of nutmeg in there listen you cannot taste it at all trust me there's another way that you can also consume it is by adding it into your smoothies when i say you guys can add it to anything <laughs> you can add it to anything you can also directly just have one teaspoon of it every day if that's what you want i would rather mix it into my food so i don't even know if it's there so here's me adding it into one of my smoothies so for the people in the back that are saying okay okay but what does it taste like by itself the answer is it doesn't really have a taste it, it's more about the texture of it in your mouth i can't really explain it but you know, it's got like a slight taste but it's basically nothing it's mostly about the texture honestly when i said anything i literally meant <laughs> anything i'm adding three teaspoons to my chicken soups so my family don't even know that they're having a good good sea moss in their food <laughs> you guys can add it to your stew your curry your gravy whatever it is that you guys are cooking you guys can add it i hope you guys enjoyed my video please leave a thumbs up if you did if you're new to my channel please subscribe and please leave in the comments of all different ways of how you guys consume it or add it to whatever food but yeah i hope you guys have a great blessed new year yeah, keep up the good energy and positivity. Manifest everything, guys. Bye.